Okay, so this first question isn't um, too terrible. It's essentially saying in the main class or somewhere we have um, declared a teacher named Gray. So there's some statement there that says teacher Gray equals new teacher. Let me extend that. So if you instantiate that. Um, and then it has all the parameters that it would take, um, which we don't need to see for the sake of this question. And there's also some sort of um, item that's declaring an array of um, called Gray's student IDs. So um, we would have a string array, which we'll learn how to declare. say there were three in there it, it's just a declaration for a new one um so essentially we're asking how to call this um random int correctly um and we want to store it in a variable named answer so first off we can see that this method returns an integer so um i'm going to store it in an integer named answer as is requested by the question and then i want to call this um, it's and to call it with the object first. They say it's in the teacher class, so we want to call it with a teacher object. So I'll do that, and then I need the random ID. And the parameters is it's accepting a student array, which we already have as gray student arrays. IDs. Um, and I put an extra S there. So we don't need these portions for the answer. Um, they're what they're describing already exists. And we would call the method um, this way with the object name, method name, because it's non-static. Remember, we call non-static methods with the object. I need to know which teacher I'm calling this method for. Um, and that would be the answer.